to Liberia. Have you guys been following the election news? This is Liberia's first democratic transition of power since 1944. I mean, it's a big deal. It is a big deal. Omar did we have won with 38% of the vote, while Joseph Bokai, the vice president to Johnson Salif since 2006, he won by 28%. Now, a third candidate insisted that there has been massive irregularities and fraud in the election process, so the case is now in court and they fixed a runoff election between the former footballer and the former vice president for November 7th. I'm not sure that it will happen on November 7th, but I was shocked that the president of Togo, you know, was one of the people called to mediate on the matter because he is the head of ECOWAS. And I'm like, uh, uh, you mean the same Nyasibe that the people of Togo have been trying to kick out? Like, <laughs> can, you, can you imagine this African people? How is he now a credible mediator? My people of Togo, I beg, how do you feel about this? Because personally, I think this is an insult. But I mean, there is nobody else. <laughs> Second of all, my people, you know, do well. Can someone please explain to me, explain to your girl, why African presidential candidates go to pastors to preach? So you understand? Maybe there is something that I don't know. But both candidates, the soccer star and the former vice president, they've gone to see Prophet T.B. Joshua for prayers. And now I'm so confused. Would T.B. Joshua pray for one and not the other? Or would he pray for both of them to win? I don't understand. Does the people vote even count at all? If they can just go to T.B. Joshua? And do we have to go to T.B. Joshua before we can talk to God? Or we are actually not talking to God? We just want to see T.B. Joshua. And you know, I have a lot of questions. <laughs> so I need your help. I need your help. Enlighten me. Enlighten your girl in the comment section. I like to hear from you guys. And of course, I'll keep you updated on the election in Liberia. You guys not know much. Guess what? I'm just keeping it real.